Alrighty, we got another rating the comments. Uh, this one is AFK Game Pro, and the map name is Mead Bill. Throw it up once we uh, get in here. AFK Game Pro, Mead Bill. Let's see what he has to say. Uh, Hey there, I would like you to raid my base. The username is AFK Game Pro and the base name is Meadville. I tried to build Harvey. Oh, is this a giant Harvey? Oh, is that? <laughs> Wait a second. That's funny. Oh, here he is. I wonder what triggered that. That's cool. Let's see what you got cooking up up here. Nice. For those that uh, come all the way up, I appreciate that. Very cool. Well, you definitely nailed Harvey. That's pretty sick. I'm trying to figure out what this is. I, I wasn't quite sure if this was him, like, extracting something, but it seems to serve a purpose, and I'm doubly thinking that because something exploded down here. So let me go down from the start and just run it. So I'm probably screwing up your jam here. Right? You got the motors running. Head out on the highway. Yeah. I don't know what... That made me think of a dead man drop, but... Okay, we got Orbeez. You know how to handle these. Oh, don't know how to handle all of those, though. Alright. That's right, Harv. Just a flesh wound. Holy balls, what the hell have you created, my man? What uh a... Oh, very good spot there. Love that. But now that that's triggered, that's good for me. Okay, so you got a couple more down here. This is a nice little kill box here. I do like it. It can be dismantled very slowly, though. But I want to try and kind of get in there. Um, this is what we're going to do. We'll let those Orbeez hit this time. No problemo. We uh, want to secure the upper part because we've already worked on that and we've already triggered some traps in that route. And this will also allow me to get, I think, several of these. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Darn. All right. We won't, uh, maybe we won't speed. We'll play it a little smarter. This is Harvey and Harvey is no fool. We knew this going in. Harvey's a brilliant little bastard. Make no mistake. He's a genius in there. How he navigates traps and... Alright, so that's what we're going to do. Is that coming in? Yeah. Ooh. Harvey was killed by Harvey. Doesn't get more poetic than that. Do this, uh, and then we're going to start... Ooh, this is going to be a slogaroonie dooney. A lot of flames. A lot of flames. A lot of Orbeez. A lot of flames. Didn't get that bolt. Which is kind of a bummer. Uh, so, we're working on the top. We should probably continue to do that. We'll do this. And actually, I need to save my shield for coming back. Although, do I just pass all this? That might be actually what I should do. So, let me try something here. Nope. Oh, I should have saved it for that. Okay. We're, we're a little smarter now. And I did get my bolts back. These are all blown up. So can I just run? I think I might be able to. So this was actually fairly easy. With grenades, I think you're kind of good. That's a problem. Sippity-doo-dod me there. 
Got a double fire on that. That's good. Like that a lot. That should do it, though. Okay. Surprise not explody. Hmm. Surprise there wasn't a spike up there. That might have gotten me, actually. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Okay. Holy balls, I am in trouble. Oh, you bombed. <laughs> this is good. This is a good kill box. Okay. I just got to think now. So. We're definitely clearing out. I think I need to save a grenade. Uh, yep, I think I do. Let me just think. I'll, I'll save the Phoenix kit for after I get in there. I think that's probably the smart play. I'm going to just start... Mm, yeah, this kind of sucks, though, because it's going to really stall my work. Oh, oh, that's a really unfortunate bounce for me. Hmm. Yeah, that's kind of problematic, if I'm being honest. That is a lot of Orbeez. Oh, that was... Oh, okay, so when I hit there. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. So let's see here. So I think what we need to do... is I think I can run past everything maybe nope that that part I can't I can't uh if I fire there or if they're hitting then I need to I have to be able to shoot that uh the pistons end here which is good so one grenade high lobbing here this should blow this up which will allow me to probably sneak, come in, and then blow that up immediately, and keep a shield. I think that's the play. Okay. So I think we can bypass this fairly easily now that we've learned it. But it is one of those where, like, you need to learn the... Like, going in blind, I don't think you can figure it out unless you get really lucky kind of zooming around, you know? So this is what we'll do. We're going to take an Orby volley, but that's okay. Because we need to do this. Get a snipe. That is one... That was really... A shit grenade. I was. Um, that's kind of a bummer. Let me just go a little lower. Yeah, it's not good. It wasn't like that one, right? That it like popped everything. So I'm in a little bit of trouble, but that's okay. Let's see what we can get done here. See, I'm doing. I'm doing it too early. Shit! 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 No, I could not get my shield going fast enough. Hmm. But we have the right idea. That's definitely the strat we need to implement. So it's it seems like it's it's doable. I need to slow down. That's my biggest issue right now, is I'm trying to rush in there. And really what I need to do is get across after throwing this grenade. Like uh, this. RV rip. Um, we got through. There we go. A couple traps destroyed on that. I need to save one of these, but really I need to slow down. Once I get to that other side, I gotta I gotta slow down. Ooh, that was not bad. I, I did okay there. Okay. Okay. We're in much better shape than we were. Kind of figured it out. Let's let this volley go. Oh, that's fucking worthy. You still got another volley there, right? And here? Okay. I thought I, I was close enough to trigger the long, but... I guess we'll do this. Did it fire both? Oh, I shot it. I just forgot. Mm, let's do this. Excuse me. That, I guess. One more up here. 
double this. And then we're going to drop this as soon as we get this. And that solves part of our problem. Okay. I think we have the makings to get out. Oh, what is... Is that new? Oh, man. This guy is... Rough. Wow, look at all that up there. So we're going to have to think this one out. We have two shots. So the first thing we absolutely need to do is get rid of the flames. 100%. These are a bummer. I didn't realize I would need to take these out. Uh, so I would have done that in the beginning. Let's see what we can trick. Okay. Oh, and those guys still have visuals on me. Okay. Double? Nope. Uh, well, let's see here. Right. I want to trigger these. Don't want to die, really. Okay. So that's good. Defense backfire. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Let's let these guys... Fire off. Hmm. This is going to be spicy, guys. I do believe. Shit. Holy crap. How many lives? Seven? Not bad. Happy with that, actually. Well, well, well. We have some things to discuss, Mr. AFK Game Pro. <laughs> uh, first of all, I believe this is a 10, 100%. You're pretty standard kill box. You got, uh, you got some minor points for the, uh, for the Harvey at the top uh, that plays no role in your base other than it looks cool. But hey, it's Harvey, right? You got to love him. Uh, I would give this a brutal right off the bat. Uh, it's a very hard base. You've covered your angles quite a bit. You've left very little options. You've put very hard traps in there. Most of them have homing or maybe not homing, but a lot of them have long shot and double fire. Uh, your fire traps are infinite. So are the, uh, excuse me, uh, the pistons, uh, that require a lot of resources. You can look down below. I've used everything to get out. Um, I don't know if it's a one you can get right off the bat. You know, like, you can't just run in and do it. I guess you could. If you really, if I was a, like, I had a lot of time, you could slowly dismantle that, come out, get the bolts, bring it back, you know, shoot these, come out, bring it back. It's a long process, but you could do it. And I've done it with other things, but it's also, it's a slog. And I kind of was like, man, if I can just get over to that side, I'd rather do that. And that's what we ended up doing. So then the formula or the plan changed to, dismantle the main row of pistons because you can always fly above them though at the end um you know dismantle those fly above get in there but you had some traps waiting and if your shield isn't on cooldown um and maybe in this case honestly this might be the base i'd advocate for like the light sword because you have so many things that like I, you know you got me on cooldown three times I think where I'm like, shit, I know I need to have a shield. I didn't save it, though. So if you had a sword, though, and you were like, whack, 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 you, you know, you might be able to get in there. I think once I hit master rank, I'm going to be running the light sword over the shield just because I kind of want to use it and get used to it. Um, and I'm 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 looking forward to bases like this where it'll help, where it's just if I can, it can swing almost as fast as I can react rather than having to wait for the shield. I'll be into it. But it's a very hard base. The 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 swarm of like every type of enemy coming at the end. That was pretty funny. But I, after the first time I knew I had to save a grenade for that. Uh, and I think we still have a Phoenix kid out there. So we had a second chance to get out, which is good, but overall very brutal. Um, I'm glad I checked it out. Cause it, it is a, it's a difficult, that's one of the more difficult kill boxes I've done. Um, and I've done a lot and that one, it's more because you're just, there aren't very many safe options. 
you know, you hit a couple of these, but you go up there, you have so many things looking at it that it's not like I can get them easily and come back. I could, but it's like, I think I could disable like a trap or two per run out into the kill box and then come back. And that sucks. And I did not want to be there for an hour. Uh, so we figured out a different strat. We are get, able to get through. I think the strat in that case is kill the last two pistons on your row, fly above, get in there, and then take out that last thing. And then you got some breathing room. Then you just figure out the gen mat corridor. You can go slower as fast as you want with that. And then prepare for the assault after you drop or do whatever. Once you take care of that assault, then it's back out. The back out was tough though too. Because your out traps with the flames and, and I thought those were homing bolts up high. Those really, uh, I was like, shit, this is going to be rough. But we had a Phoenix kit. We had an extra try. But overall, uh, seven deaths with it. I think, I'm trying to think. I feel like I could have done it in five, maybe. If I was a little more careful. Like if I had thought it out and been like, hey, you got to save your shield. But I do think I, I would have died five times in my head. I think that's how many deaths this would have taken from me. So overall, really deadly base. Uh, thanks for sending that in, man. Really cool. And uh, I love the Harvey design at the top.